guys, welcome to the next segment of 7 Minutes with Seema. This segment is really just another, this is basically a yoga flow. It would be great for runners, crossfitters, because we're going to do a lot of hip opening. But really this is just like something that I have been playing with around on my mat. So let's go ahead and get started. Come into downward facing dog. Pedal your feet. Shake your head yes, shake your head no. Inhale, lift your right leg straight up and back. Exhale, step your right foot between your hands. Turn your right foot out 45 degrees and then reach your right arm to the back of the room. Push into your left hand so you're not sinking your hips to the ground, so you're lifting up and away. Great, and then from here, inhale your way, or exhale your way into your side lunge, keeping your left foot flat and reaching your right toes toward your head. We're gonna to continue to spiral, spin it around, so you're gonna continue spinning. This time, reach your left foot out 45 degrees and then reach your left arm to the back of the room. And then coming into the middle, Take your hands down flat, bend your right knee, bend your left knee so you're staying center here, and then exhale, find your way back to the front of your mat, and step back, chaturanga. Inhale, open it up, upward facing, exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your left leg straight up and back, exhale, step it between your hands. Inhale, turn your left foot out 45 degrees. Reach your left arm to the back of the room. Again, push into your right hand so you're lifting away from the floor. And then swing it around. Bend your right knee, straighten your left leg. Keep your right foot flat. Keep spinning it around. Inhaling, turning your right toes out, reaching your right arm back. And then here we are. Sorry for the view, my friends. Keep your hands center. Bend your left knee. Bend your right knee. Come back to the front of the room. And then exhale your way back, chaturanga. Inhale, open it up. And exhale, take it back. Inhale, look to the front of your mat. Exhale, hop, walk, or float. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale and fold. Inhale, ukatasana, chair pose. Bend your knees, float your hips down. Exhale, swing your hands back. Inhale, open your arms up. Exhale, swing your hands back. Inhale, your arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, plant your hands, lift your knees to your upper arms. So this is crow prep. Just push your knees into your arms if you're still learning the crow pose. Otherwise, you can lift one foot up and then put it down, lift the other foot. You can start to do a little crow tap dance. Or you can lift up into your crow pose. Flex your feet, chaturanga. Inhale, upward. Exhale, downward. Inhale, lift your right leg up. Exhale, step it between your hands. Inhale. Spin it open. Exhale, take it back into your side lunge. Great. Keep it moving. Inhaling it to the back of the room, lifting your left arm. Come back through center. This time you can play here. You can stand your forward fold. You can take a headstand. You can take a handstand. You can take a forearm stand. Or you can simply just stay here and breathe. Great. So I'll demo that for you. And then slowly come back to the front of your mat. You're gonna cartwheel your arms open as you breathe out, warrior two. Inhale, reverse warrior, reaching back. Straighten your front leg. Come forward, triangle pose, letting your right hand drop to your knee, shin or ankle as you gaze over your left fingertips. Nice, deep breathing. Take one more big breath out. Inhale, lifting back up, warrior two. Exhale, your hands down. Step it back, chaturanga. Inhale, open it up, upward facing. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your left leg straight up and back. Exhale, low lunge, step it between your hands. Inhale, spin it open, reaching your left arm back. Exhale, side lunge, bending your right knee, straightening your left leg. Keep spinning to the back of the room, turning it out, lifting your right arm up, pushing the floor away. And then coming back through center. So again, you can either stay right here, you can lift up, right? So last time I just stayed on the ground. This time I'm gonna lift up into my forearm stand. So just playing here, right? And again, the forward fold is great. Slowly come down if you're up. Remembering that the way down is just as important as the way up. back to the front of your mat. 
You're going to exhale your way up into your warrior two. Inhale, take it back, reverse. And then straight your front leg. Exhale your way into triangle pose, letting your left hand drop to knee, shin, or ankle as you gaze over your right fingertips. Nice deep breathing here. Plug your left thigh right back into your hip socket. Lengthen both sides of your body. Take one more big breath out. Inhale your way back up, warrior two. Exhale your hands down. Step it back. Chaturanga. Inhale, open it up, upward facing. Exhale, downward facing dog. Nice deep breathing. So we're going to move through that flow, this time a little bit faster. Inhale, lift your right leg straight up and back. Exhale, the lunge. Inhale, spin it open. Exhale to the back of your mat, side lunge. Inhale, keep it moving, reach it around. Exhale, come back through center. You've got your fold, you've got a handstand, you've got a headstand, whatever you want to do. You're going to spin it back to the front of your mat once you're done with that. Inhaling, lifting up, or I'm sorry, exhale, lifting up. Inhale, reverse warrior, straighten your front leg. Exhale, triangle pose, letting your right hand drop down, knee, shin, or ankle. Breathing deep. One more big breath out. Inhale, lifting back up, warrior two. Exhale, your hands down. Step it back, chaturanga. Inhale, open it up. Exhale, take it back. Inhale, lift your left leg high. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, spin it around. Exhale, take it to the back of your mat. Bending your right knee, straightening your left leg. Keep it moving, spin it around. Turn your right foot out, reach your right arm back. Come back to the middle of your mat. You have your playtime right here. Again, you can stay in the fold. If you're working the fold, you can take different variations, perhaps. Right? You can go upside down, wherever you're at. Lifting or coming down if you're down, if you're, you know what I mean, if you're up, come down. If you're down, come up. Pivot to the front of your mat. Lift it up as you breathe out, warrior two. Inhale, reverse warrior, reaching up and back. Straighten your front leg. Exhale, triangle pose. Letting your left hand drop to your knee, chin, or ankle as you gaze over your right fingertips. One more big breath out. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, your hands down. Step it back, chaturanga. Inhale, breathe up, upward facing. Exhale, downward facing dog. Go ahead and drop into your knees. Come back to a child's pose. All right, guys. Thanks for checking in. That's a great way just to literally circle your way around your mat and just play with new variations. Have a great day. Bye.